What is good everyone and welcome back and we are doing our thing and you are seeing on the screen right here We have continued to get dubs in the playoffs, which means there is another game coming up versus not an easy opponent Now these are Madden 23 updated rosters. We are playing the Cleveland Browns, which means Deshaun Watson is the quarterback for the team on top of that they have some new acquisitions as well that they made from last season to go into this season. So you will be seeing that. But their star player will be Miles Garrett, the defensive player, maybe of the year. 99 overall. He's unstoppable. And we're going to need to somehow stop him so that he does not destroy us throughout the game. Now, make sure you guys do smash that thumbs up if you are enjoying the series and cannot wait for the new Madden to drop, which is in like two days. The videos are going to be crazy, but you guys are seeing. We are taking on the Browns, like I said, and then the Bucks are taking on the Cowboys in the NFC Championship game. So these games have been mostly blowouts. I mean, look at the score. The only game that's really been close has been um, our game versus the Baltimore Ravens in the wild card game where we won in overtime. That was intense by three points. But other than that, every game has basically been... I would say like a blowout, like a destruction. So let's see how this one goes. But like I said before, Deshaun Watson is the starting quarterback for the Cleveland Browns. He's a 92 overall, which means he's very good, very good. And he can pass the ball. And on top of that, he can also run as well with speed 85, acceleration 89. Really? That's really good. Now look at the running back and Nick Chubb is a 99 overall and then Kareem Hunt who's a 90 overall. This is not going to be easy to stop them. And then look at the receivers. Amari Cooper is their number one. Peoples Jones is number two. Then they got James Jr. is number three. Now Peoples Jones at 75 overall and Richie James Jr. at 74 overall are not the best. But they do have, like I said, 93 overall Amari Cooper who's going to be a stud all game long so we're gonna have to somehow i don't know how but somehow find a way to stop him now they have david and joku as well um at the tight end position 83 overall their offensive line is not too bad not too shabby but i believe we can still get to the quarterback with jeffrey simmons the defensive player of the year uh, who's on our team now chase uh Winovic, left end miles garrett like i said is the right end at 99 overall two 99 overall players on their team that's crazy. That's that's one on offense, one on defense. Okay, okay. Don't get too out of hands, right? Don't don't get too nervous now. You guys are seeing um, left outside linebacker, not too good. The middle linebacker, Anthony Walker Jr., 79 overall, I believe will be able to uh, you know throw the ball around him. Not too good as well. The right outside linebacker, 83, is not too bad. But look at the cornerbacks. Denzel Ward, 91 overall, has a lot of speed. 95 speed, 95 acceleration. That is not going to be a player I want to throw the ball to, or at least on his side, because he's going to be able to keep up with everybody on my team. Ronnie Harrison Jr. is the strong safety, and then uh, that does conclude their team, which means we got to jump to the game right here, and hopefully, hopefully, we can get some dubs. Easy, short pass, broken tackle, and we are going to pick up a first down um, early on in this game. So it's going to be a methodical movement, and we got to make sure that Miles Garrett, who's going to be chasing us all game long, um, does not get to Derrick Henry because one, we want no injuries, but two, he has been fumbling a lot. So I got to make sure that I stop fumbling. Like, I got to. Oh, here we go. We tricked him right in the field, and we do pick up a first down. First and 10, once again, early on in this game. Throwing the ball. No, we don't. Look at this. What'd I say? Miles Garrett already getting after Derrick Henry. This man was able to just throw down his defender and get to the quarterback, but it's all good because look at this. Wide open receiver down the field. Derrick Henry threw it off his back foot. He wasn't even balanced when he threw that, and I was still able to get enough power and actually on it. Look at that. A bullet pass, 
to get to the receiver. Then he ran to the end zone. Then we got a touchdown. And now we are up seven to three. And look who's there again. Derrick Henry. Not Derrick Henry. Well, it is Derrick Henry, but Miles Garrett is there to take down Derrick Henry. And they've been cooking. Second and 14, we're going deep right here. And we do end up finding a receiver who is able to beat the defender right down the field. Second and 12, we're going to throw a ball across the middle. Good broken tackle. And Robert Woods is there. He did end up being the number one receiver in the NFL in our season. So with that being the case, run. Oh, oh. I got to stop fumbling. What, what is this? We have to stop fumbling, man. We have to stop fumbling. We're going to run right here. And we are going to run the ball in the end zone with Derrick Henry. One passing, one rushing touchdown so far. What is this? What kind of dance moves are those? There we go again. There we go again. A very good job by our defense as well to get us in a very good field position. So I don't have to go far to get into the end zone, which is going to be clutch. Because we do it again right here. And we are getting points on the board. Points on the board. Twenty-four to thirteen. What do you mean? We're running down the field right here, and we are able to pick up a lot of yards. Broken tackle, and then we do end up getting tackled, but that is okay because we are cooking now. If you look at the bottom of the screen right here, it says that the Tampa Bay Buccaneers ended up beating the Cowboys twenty-four to fourteen. So the winner of this game will be playing the Bucks in the Super Bowl. And what a great pass! Good spot once again. Touchdown once again. It looks like we are running away with this. Now, after Derrick Henry uh, was not able to get away from Miles Garrett a couple times, I think that our O-line stepped up a little bit, just a little bit, and just enough to where Miles Garrett has not been able to get to Derrick Henry anymore so far. And with that being the case, I have time to throw the ball, move it down the field, and score some touchdowns. 31 to 13, what do you mean in this third quarter? Throwing the ball deep right here once again, and look at this. Give Derrick Henry enough time. Give him enough space. It's going to be a wrap, bro. It is going to be a wrap. Another first down pickup. Not much time on the clock left, but we're going to find back to the end zone. We do. Austin Hooper is there. TDs for days again, but we are running rampant today. No regard. For anybody besides ourselves. Look at this. Defense is playing great, getting us in good field position once again. And I don't have to go far to score another touchdown. I am right here, at least in field goal range. Throwing the ball in. We do end up getting to the one yard line with Austin Hooper, which means we are going to fight. Or in this case, just walk into the end zone. Way too easy. More TDs. We're in the third quarter, scoring 45 points so far. Another bomb. And okay. INT. Forty five to twenty three. Another great pass. Another great catch. Austin Hooper has been open all game long and he's been able to make every catch. Um, that has basically gone to him. A good run right here by the running back, and that is another first down pickup. Now it is time for us to basically just, you know, keep running. No end zone right there, but we stayed in bounds. Make sure the clock keeps moving. Because this game is basically, no, it is. It's over. It's, it's way over. Yeah, look at this. It's over. It's over, over. This is destruction. 52 to 23. Oh, bruh. 
I mean, at this point, what else can I say besides we are the best team right now in the NFL? I don't care what the Bucks are doing. I don't care how many games. Oh, they only lost one game, two games. That's fine. Look what we're doing offensively and defensively, scoring almost 60 points in a championship game, almost 60. This is not going to be fun for the Bucks. And with that being the case, we are the AFC champions of the world. And let's look at some stats before we end this game. Derrick Henry, 132.4 QBR, 24 for 35, 382 yards, six touchdowns. Yes, six in one pick. Nick Chubb, not even 100 rushing yards, man. Derrick Henry did, though. Derrick Henry did. 15 yards, or 15 attempts, 149 yards, two touchdowns, and he fumbled. We got to cut out these um, turnovers. Well, technically, only one turnover because the fumble actually got the ball back, but still, I'm tired of it. But trust me, nobody believed in Derrick Henry could be a good quarterback, but God did. Nobody believed Derrick Henry could be a good quarterback. But God did. Y'all get that reference? DJ Khaled? Okay, anyways. Um, yards after yards after yards. A lot of players on our team. I think, what, three players on our team had over th or over 100 yards receiving today and at least one touchdown. Before we end the video, we're going to look at the Pro Bowl lineup. Now, you guys will not see any of our players or the Buccaneers players because they will be in the playoffs or the um, championship game, the Super Bowl. We will be in the Super Bowl, so none of our players will play in this game. But you are seeing players that did end up making the Pro Bowl. Comment down below and let me know if you see any of your favorite uh, players. And if you do see your favorite player, comment down below and let us know who it is. There's Juju Smith-Schuster, who made the Pro Bowl as a fourth-string receiver at an 83 overall. Marcus Valdez-Scantling, 78 overall. Okay. I mean... You'd expect to see maybe a little bit higher overall players, but it doesn't matter what overall you are. If you're cooking, you're cooking. Left ends, Aaron Donald, J.J. Watt, Robert Quinn. Wow, that is a Von Miller, Miles Garrett, of course. Um, Bosa. I'm trying to see if anybody random. Look at this. Who's Dean for the NFC team? A 75 overall middle linebacker made it as the second string linebacker in the Pro Bowl. Who is this guy? 75 overall? He must be nice. And look at this guy, Thompson, on the NFC as well. 73 overall made it as a Pro Bowler. Okay. A punt returner that's a 69 overall. He's probably just fast, to be completely honest. But you guys are seeing, like I said before, we ended up winning. The Bucks ended up winning, which means... Tennessee Titans, number two overall seed versus the number one overall seed. And the overall, I guess, best team um, this season, the Buccaneers, will be playing in the Super Bowl. Who do you think will win? Comment down below. Let your boy know. But I will see you in the next episode. And I am.